okay hello dear friends good afternoon such a beautiful beautiful afternoon and here i come to which way is a little bit better okay so today i came to uh, san francisco Legion, Legion d'honneur legend of honor museum and there are exhibitions, but mostly I just want to uh, want to come and see. It's such a beautiful museum, and there are many new things. So let's do an outfit of the day. This is my outfit. And it's a very, very comfortable dress. feel that uh, there are much more things here now comparing with uh, previously I come here and I was quite busy these uh, couple of months and uh, I haven't come here for quite some long time almost uh, three months four months or half a year three months four months around this time and this time i came i see there are so many new things and all these paintings are new and this furniture seems new i think the new management or the new boss or they just uh, want to show more things which is uh, no matter which management, it is just so good that, uh, that we get to see more things. And uh, those antiquity, those antique uh, treasures is better to be seen and to be appreciated then staying inside, don't you agree? What a beautiful and elegant, perfect shaped sculpture. And uh, I think today we will just uh, walk around. It's uh, very much deserve my membership, more than deserve my membership. And uh, I will fully utilize it and come here more often we have uh, one hour of time so i will choose some of the paintings that uh, that uh, i am more touched or i want to take a close look to explain you so good. So here I am adding some voice over, and this is one of uh, one of uh, the exhibition that has been always there, the roof. And uh, there are some new exhibitions from time to time. Dio Museum, actually here is uh, Legend of uh, Honor, Légion d'Honneur. They usually have very classic European art. And this time they have something quite interesting. This is like a mirror house. And uh, I did not understand very well, but just uh, mesmerized by seeing the parallel image, the reflection of... Uh, of uh, the the elements, including myself, and um, in this very uh, traditional and classic museum, you see something new and different. is uh, eye opening and interesting, and still it's made very very beautiful. This design, 
the design and、uh, arrangement is、uh, very eye pleasing, right? So it's been.、Uh, there are some new paintings. So, for example, these two I have never seen, and this one I have not seen. Albert Albert Joseph Moore. And this is such a beautiful painting, and in a relatively small scale. And you see the background is just fantastic, and this one is a Henry Meyer, Meyer、uh, here, and I think we have done a video about this painting. This is such a beautiful, beautiful. It's beauty at its prime. Beautiful shape, beautiful expression, and the background. And this one also, same by Albert Joseph Moore. But this time, I am particularly attracted by this piece of painting. Usually, I come to museum, and、uh, I do not see very much. Paintings with uh, with uh, a human figure because it's just too hard and it is so hopeless for me. But this one, it immediately attracted me because there is so much, so much poetry in this painting, and it's relatively dark. The room is dark. The clothing is dark. Everything is relatively dark, but there is this flower flash out. This very bright flower, and the window, and a little bit of、uh, the young lady's skin, and it actually feels. That in such a dark place, in such a dark environment, her chin, her arm—it's so stunningly bright, pure, and elegant, and the contrast brings. Much more intensity of the feeling of this room. It's it's quite unbelievable how is she smelling the flower. In my studio, this might be this young lady in the artist studio is doing a poster, so the the painter can do the painting, figure drawing, but、uh, or maybe she is preparing preparing、uh, the flower. Maybe she is、uh, the maid. To Prepare the flower, or maybe she is、uh, the household lady. The carpet on the table is perfect for for、uh, painting with the right reflection. Wow. Okay, so. It's a, a wonderful, wonderful art piece, but I'm feeling that I am doing a disservice to this wonderful artwork.
because I did not know about the background. I did not know uh, about uh, the artistic expression. And uh, there must be a lot of stories behind it. Same as every artwork, the, the production, the creation period, the creation process, there is uh, so much involved. And uh, I do not know the story. So I think I will leave it to you and to myself the imagination. Let's just humbly and uh, wholeheartedly admire and appreciate these artists. They spend their life every day step by step stroke by stroke, piece by piece, practice, learn, practice, work, practice, practice, practice. So keep on practice. I very, very strongly Believe, believing, believe in practice. And, uh, and this is a part of my, my way of living, of my philosophy of living, of philosophy of learning. There is no, no replacement of hard working, of practice. Never give up. Keep on practice. Going to uh, uh, this uh, classic art museum is a very humbling experience because, because these are the accumulation of practice and I love it and uh, I so 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 admire these artworks I may be too old styled but the classic art museum is the nourishment of my soul because of its beauty and because of uh, because of the hard working value behind these beautiful works and uh, it's just plain fact that it's the accumulation of practice, work, passion, and 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 dedication and it's so profound it's a good place to stop I love you I really do 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 bye bye friends if you have time go to classic art museum They are good for our soul.